Right folks, this is something I have been waiting for for a few weeks now. Um, I've gone on Instagram and i seen this bloke and he does these trainers. And he personalises them to your club. Um, so, I got in touch. Uh, his name is Terrace Trainers Recovery. Terrace, as in I suppose the football terrace. Uh, and trainers recovery and what he does he'll put the team of your choice on the side of your trainers um, he can do all kinds of things with them he actually also does your old trainers and cleans them up you've got to have a look at his site on uh, instagram it's well well worth a look now what i've done folks is i wanted a pair of leicester city trainers and um Let's be honest, right, they cost £110, um, but the work he puts in and the detail and stuff is well worth it. Um, I'm not sure how much these new uh, these trainers cost new uh, to buy, but, you know, it's one of them things. Um, it's got to be done. So, what I did, sent, I got in touch with him, he sent me a pair, and uh, they've just arrived this morning. And what I'm going to do, folks, I am going to show you them. And uh, I... He, uh, he actually offered uh, a discount and I says, no, it's your living, don't be stupid. I'll pay the full price and all that, I, it don't matter, man. Uh, so there it is, folks, I paid £111 for him. Now, what I did, I asked him a few, train, uh, a few trainer questions, um, a few questions. Uh, 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 right, where is it? Uh, right, he's uh, sent me a bit of info. Uh, the trainers have been waterproofed as you can test by running the toe under a tap. I am not going to run the toe uh, under a tap uh, at the moment, right? Because I'm just not going to do it. Um, but I trust him. Uh, it, will be, it will bounce off. As they are waterproof, they should, shouldn't get too dirty to begin with. But when they do, I recommend using a trainer cleaning and soft bristled brush. Brush the solution in and then wipe away the excess foam with the microfiber cloth. Uh, stuff the toe box and leave to dry for, naturally for 24 hours. Don't brush too hard with these as the suede is so soft. You could end up uh, taking the colour out of the train. It's just a very lightly buff. Uh, the labels, uh, is, you get labels as well that goes on the box and everything like that. It's just good. It's, so it's basically just a pair of trainers, folks. But you, you, I mean, look after them. Don't go like playing football in them. Or you'll scuff them up and they'll be fucked. Um, so this is the box. I've got my own little sticker, Blue Van Man, uh, Leicester City, and Adidas, and I've got the old retro style Foxes badge. Um, let's have a look. Right, he sent me some uh, Leicester City specials. These are all the little stickers that you get. Uh, there you go. Uh, I don't know why he sent me a Leeds United one. He's probably a Leeds fan, and uh, it has to be done. Um, right. The recovery trainer, that's that's his uh, company there, folks. Yeah. Foxy's never quit. Another little sticker. And um, there is his Terrace Trainer Recovery. Bring your favourite trainers back to life. Terrace Trainers Recovery at Outlook.com. Uh, Blue Van Man, hope you like them. Thanks for the support. Cheers, Ray at TTR. Um, Jeans 2, 1980 training shoe. So that's basically what we've got, folks. Uh, launched in 1980 as a training shoe, this edition of the jeans became a much-loved cult classic among the terrorist community. Featuring the iconic T-toe overlay and heel stabilisers for the first time in the style, the silhouette took on a new featuring a uh, full premium suede upper and velour stripes. Uh, it sits on the original and never before reissued rubber sole, rubber outsole with tray file detailing. Uh, release of uh, year release is 1980. So there we have it, folks. Um, I've got a pack of sweets, Yorkshire's finest mixtures. Right then, let's tuck in. Um, and this is it, folks. This is the deal. Uh, I don't normally like putting new shoes on the tray on the table because all that um, gubbins. But there it is, and that's what we've got. Adidas Leicester. What do you reckon, folks? Uh, there's a little retro badge on the back. Now, these are a size 13. 
I, I do like Adidas. I, 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 I struggle to get Adidas trainers because my foot is so wide. Um, it's a bit of a pain in the arse to get them that fit me. Uh, but if I do find a pair of size 13, I've got to get them. Uh, my dragons are a size 13, uh, and that's it really. But uh, there we go. And there it is, all the little gubbins on, blue van man. You know, he, he, he personalises them as, as much as he possibly can. Um, it's one of those things. So. Let's do it. Let's get rid of that. Put them in the box to save. So do the laces. Now all this lovely, I love all this kind of stuff. That Adidas. Uh, the visually impaired, you have got no idea what I'm on about. Uh, but it's just, it's just typical Adidas. I suppose it's like any typical trainer, isn't it? Right. Let's put them on. Oh yeah. Oh. Yes, lovely. Oh, I have this thing, has anybody else got this thing where, um, if I'm trying a pair of shoes on, I know if I do the right foot first, I know the left one's gonna fit, because it seems like my left, my right foot is bigger than my left. I don't know why. Oh, better uh, tissue out, so that's gonna work. You took, uh... No, I don't think you do, do you? I don't think you do do the last uh, hole up on the trainer. Right. Oh, yes. And here we have it, folks. Let's uh, put the camera on the floor. Make sure I don't turn the camera off. And how's that? See that, folks? Ooh. What do you reckon, folks? They're good. I mean, they're, they're really wide as well. So I am more than happy with them. Right. Yes, folks? What do you reckon? So, like I say, he does, he does all other clubs as well. He does, uh, well, don't just think he does, he do, just have a look at his site um, and he'll just do anything you like. Uh, he does Forest, Celtic, Rangers, Liverpool, Man United, Poppy Day, he even does trainers for Poppy Day. He does an England one, I've, he, he just does loads. If you just get in touch with him, I'm, I'm gonna, I'll try and put a link at the bottom of this. And uh, we'll go from there, folks. It's really good. Like I say, it's £110. I suppose could be classed as a lot of money, um, but it's, it's just that little personal touch of uh, having your club on there. Uh, it's just well worth looking at, I think, folks. I don't really know what to say, what else to say. It's just a piece of retro history, and to have your club. Uh, team or whatever thing that you want on there, it um, it just adds that little bit of a touch, don't it? What do you think, folks? Just waterproof, and they're good a solid trainer. I like them. I'm glad I've done it. 
um, I'm glad I've done it because they are just a quality trainer and it goes along with more Adidas stuff so people that can uh, uh, anybody from Adidas and you want to sponsor me I'm here you know <laughs> I've spent a lot of money on Adidas in the past um, all right folks I'm gonna leave that there um, oh, like I say I'll put the uh, Terrace Trainer Recovery they're an ideal pro, uh, present for somebody's birthday, Christmas, whatever. Football season, yeah? You could, I suppose, I wonder if you can personalise them yourself, or if you can just, like, ask. So, if Liverpool, when Liverpool win the league this year, they could actually have, like, 2019-2020 or something on it. I don't know, folks. It's an idea. Uh, I'll leave it with you. Get in touch with him and go for it. All right, folks. Laters.